position. Okay, we're good. Hey guys. Good day. Pizza, garlic knots, salad, and Kaki's got a plate of crust. I do. I saved the crust. I told I her like I wasn't the... sharing tonight. I like the crust. I was very honest. Oh no, about he's that. sharing. He just doesn't have a choice. No, no what happened was I was gonna do something. I've been talking for years about doing something with the crust I cut off, right? Besides giving it to the dogs. And um, tonight was going to be that night, and then my brother was tattooing and, you know, other stuff, and he came and just started eating the crust. I'm like, I guess I'm not doing something with the crust. Like, he's like, I'll eat the crust. Hello, Abby, I'll Christine. Eat the crust. I got some dipping sauces, too. Frank, <laughs> Chastity, how Hello, are you guys Abby. doing tonight? Hello, Abby. Hello, Christine. Hello, Chastity. Mama Llama. I love it Mama when a, Llama. I love it when a room just comes to oh, life. Oh, you went on TikTok? I didn't think yeah. you did. What's up, Matthew? Queen I Susie. Back from taking and, and I turned my volume down. Why the hell is it down? Because you didn't turn your volume down. But I down. did, though. <laughs> All right. Yeah, we're both doing pizza tonight, Abby. I don't know how much khaki's going to eat. Yeah, I don't know. We got salad and garlic knots, too. So, this well, bad Jamie boy. Jamie has garlic knots. I'm not eating garlic knots. Hello, Diana. Tater Hello, the Diana. skater. Hello, Kelly. Sabrina. Tater the skater. I wish Hello. every night was like this, where boys and girls just pop on all in, come come in all at together. Like, hey, the door's unlocked. Come on in. Come on in, guys. You know what I just <laughs> noticed? TikTok asks me to set a goal on the live, and it has like a little green dinosaur. I didn't know. What, a set I, a goal. Yeah, it says set though? a goal. It says this might help you engage in your in more audience or something like that. I didn't know, so I just didn't do anything. I had some soup with broth. Nice. I had some soup with rotini noodles and roasted chicken base. Nice. I'm sure it tasted delicious. Homemade cinnamon rolls? Very nice, Abby. Kaki used the rest of the cookie dough tonight, so maybe tomorrow we might take a ride to <coughs> Cinnabon <coughs> and get some delicious gooeyness going on for me tomorrow night. What's up, Moon Dancer? I saw somebody make donuts out of cinnamon rolls the other day. I, I like, saw oh. somebody do something with donut, cut up donuts and like pumpkin spice, and I'm like, I'm out. No, I saw somebody take like actual cinnamon rolls, cut a hole in them, and they they cook them like donuts. Mm. I'm sorry, Moon Dancer. I hope everything is okay now. Who is TikTok? Dudes with the computer? I don't even think so. Oh, Sabrina. Moon Dancer, I'm sorry, girl. Did you see Ronda Rousey in Ring of Honor tonight? No, I don't watch Ring of Honor. Where'd you see Ring of Honor? I watched, I had AEW on all night, but it was... I thought that was the same thing. Well, Tony Khan owns Ring of Honor, but they don't have a TV deal. Hello, Johnny Bees. How you doing, man? Johnny Bees. What's up, John? Your burritos look delicious, by the way. You've seen it on Twitter. Okay. Yeah, no, I, I was on Twitter, but I was looking at other stuff. <laughs> Christine said she's eating pizza from 7 Eleven. There's nothing wrong with that. Their pizza's not bad. Anybody that does like 7 Eleven pizza, because, you know, is what it is. You could go there and order a pie and they'll cook it for you. Ask them to take it out five minutes early. Therefore, when you get home, you put it in the oven for two minutes at a high 450 and watch that cheese really start to dance and it tastes, you wouldn't even know it's 7 Eleven pizza. What's hey, up, Monica? Monica? How you doing, girl? Jake, show me coke. Ugh. Hello, John. I got the hacks for making your typical fast food experience more of a uh, an exciting uh, experience, if you know what I mean. You must. What? I said you must. I didn't listen. Former fat guy, I'm still fat at heart. Like, there's no denying that one. Like, I can't... I'll cut them all so you can just grab with whatever you want. I figured I would leave you the big one with the crust that I left. Yeah, leave me the one with the crust. Because I ain't dealing with that shit tonight. I like the one with the crust. I like the crust, though. I will try that. Love that show. Haha, <laughs> Jinx. What's up, Jamie? What's up, David Lagunas? How are you? I thought you were not doing pizza again tonight. 
John, you must not know me well, pal. John, you must know... Listen, whenever Jamie says, I'm not doing pizza, just know whenever Jamie says that, he's doing pizza. I he's will... He's always doing pizza. Put it this way, and I will defend myself. And if it's a Friday, there's going to be pizza. Even if Jamie, on a Thursday, says, I'm not eating pizza. No, 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 hear me out. I'm, I'm being <laughs> dead serious on he this. He eats pizza. The place that I got my pizza when I'm at work is my second favorite place, right? And if that was my choice to have that tonight, I would not have eaten it. My normal pizza place, it's pizza, but it's a distinct taste. I can't get this taste anywhere else. can't even create it myself. So, yes, I'm eating pizza, but this is more of what my heart is hungry for. Does that make sense? What's up? Uh, what's up? <laughs> the dork night. I love your videos. Thank you very much. You know what I mean? Like, there's certain things that you just can't duplicate the taste. And this place that I go for... Uh, for my pizza is one of a kind. Simple as that. Right, so I know this one's my slice. Yeah, take whatever you want. Mm -hmm. I'm probably not eating a lot. Well, we'll eat, we'll talk, we'll have fun. We'll let <laughs> the night take us away. Pour hot sauce on it. We don't have any hot sauce. Jackie, how's your crust? My crust is actually very good, Abby. I love the crust. You know what I love more? Balsamic food. Balsamically is like my absolute favorite. What's up, Try Rob? Try not to get it on Jamie's slices. Why do you Why do you eat on live? Hey, Rob. You know what? Want to know something? I've been eating on live, social media, every single night for over six years. Haven't missed one night. Went from a fat, three hundred pound alcoholic to the man you're looking at right now. That's a true story. Mm -hmm. I'm not just trying to blow smoke up up anybody's ass. Proof's in the pudding. I started out 300 pounds over six years ago every single night since then. Oh. I haven't missed one night. So it's kind of like a routine that I'm, um, I would probably feel lost without it. Yo, balsamic glaze sounds amazing. On pizza, yes it is. Matt R, yes it is. And if you haven't tried it, you need to. Because I've turned a bunch of people onto it. Especially like one person in particular, which happens to be like one of my now good really friends. Who? <clears throat> Munchkin. Now that's the only thing she does. A crazy plus, chick that was eating Chinese food oh, you no, were no. watching plus, before. Plus Emmy. Emmy now does it on pizza. Does she? Yes, she does. Oh, that's she right. Sent, she sent me a picture the other she day. She sent me she sent, she sent me two pictures of her eating balsamic on pizza. Mm. I'm like, oh my god, it's so good. You gotta try it. Um Jeez, mm. oh, what was I going to say? Oh, speaking of gas, <laughs> TikTok Sheriff. My belly's been making these noises oh all God. day long. Before I went for my run tonight, Khaki's like, go to the bathroom. My, me, me, my brother, and Khaki were hanging out in the kitchen before my run. <laughs> and you just hear my stomach. Like, like, <laughs> <"Bruh."> <laughs> it's like Bruh. Bruh. hello, Cortland. I'm just like, oh my God, hello, Court. Khaki's How like, are you my friend? She's oh, like, balsamic glaze and vanilla ice cream. Never tried that. That might be good. She's like, you need to go to the bathroom. And then he, she's like, I'm not picking you up if you call me halfway to, when you're on your run. He's if like, you, I'm not coming to pick you up. Yeah. Had a if good run. If you poop your pants, I'm not coming to help you. <laughs> I'm coming. He just needs to run home and shower. <laughs> Let's just say there was no problems. I had a good run. But when I got home, it sounded like there was a bunch of elephants trapped in my in my bathroom. What's up, Mark? Chastity, have you never seen balsamic glaze on here? I use balsamic glaze all the time. Anytime I eat pizza, you don't need the camera. always balsamic glaze, one hundred percent. Sounds like an emergency dump is on the way, brother. <laughs> yes, <laughs> it's not delivery; it's DiGiorno. This or it's happened. the diarrhea. <laughs> Either one. <laughs> you get the bubbly guts, John, from drinking your veggie shakes? Kagi seems to think it was the pizza I had yesterday that did it to me. Because this happened to him yesterday. He yeah. was literally sitting in the kitchen like after he ate the pizza, like hours after he ate the pizza. And he was just like, and we were just listening to his song. He said it was like, bro, bro. I'm like, what the hell do you mean? He's like, just pizza. And I'm like, 
I hope yeah. you're not becoming lactose intolerant. Wouldn't that <laughs> suck? Hello, Jimmy. What's up, Turtle Wouldn't that Baggins? suck big time if Jamie became like lactose intolerant? Can, can you? That means I can't have uh, milk, right? You can't have cheese. You can't have milk. I would. I would be. I would be ruined. <laughs> you would see bread. Actually, you'd still eat it. You would just suffer the consequences. I would probably do that for a certain amount of time, and then I would change my whole. I would change everything around. If it's not good for my body, I would change everything around and start something new. Uh, price to give you gas. I turned lactose intolerant at 35. I take a pill. Yeah, it's cool. they have a pill for that. Yeah. And forever said the pizza looks dry. Pizza's not dry. Hell no. Mm -mm. This pizza is so good. I wish you guys could experience the taste that's going on in my mouth right now. And Marks, I'm having the same thing as Jamie. Pizza. And I have salad. And I have the leftover crust that I'm going to dip in some sauce. Because honestly, I just want a one piece of pizza. That's it. What do you think about tomorrow? He's wearing a pizza necklace every night. I got him that pizza necklace. Jackie and the kids got it for me. You like pizza and milk? Jimmy, I used to drink milk with my dinner every night. I don't know, Marks is okay, girl. No worries. Hello, Cassandra. Hello, How are you? Hello, Cass. Are you feeling better? Mm, my nasal my nasal issue cleared up, but now I have a really bad headache, so. Take one, trade it for the other. Don't know. I do feel better than I did, but my head hurts. We used to have dinner. We used to drink milk every night for dinner. Now I hardly touch it. Really? What's up, Mr. Savvy? Hello, Mr. Savvy. I don't like milk. I can't drink milk. The thought of drinking milk makes me want to throw up. What's up, David? <laughs> I do not like milk. First time with us live? Cold milk with if pizza so, hits the spot. I'm happy you're here, too. I don't like milk. Me too, G-Sir. So, my cookie cupcakes that I have behind me, I have the routine. Like most of the shit I do. And I before me and Kaki go to bed, I tap the ice cream on the cookie cupcakes, which I already did. I actually cut them in half like little sandwiches and put ice cream inside. And then before I go to bed, I pour my glass of milk and I put it in the fridge. So when I come down in the morning, it's extra cold. It's super cold, apparently. Try organic milk? No. John, I don't like milk in general. In general, I think milk is disgusting. I can't drink it. I will throw up. Uh, try organic. Yeah, that's what I said. I'm probably, I, I probably have gotten Yeah, it. Court agreed to, which really, it has to be ice cold. Cold milk. Well, who the hell's drinking warm milk? That's what I'm wondering. Drink who's warm drinking milk to go to bed at night. Who, who's drinking warm milk when you're, when you're eating cookies? Well, that's true. First of all, warm milk is equally as disgusting as actual regular milk. <laughs> Do you have any fast food hacks? What's your fast food of what's your fast food choice of uh, place of choice? Cause like for me, fast food is McDonald's. That's my favorite. Now I've had my fair share of fast food places, but um Nannies are drinking warm milk tonight. L O L Yeah, I don't like warm milk. Warm milk good with I can't drink, I, listen, I can't drink milk in general. Cold, warm, don't like it, I think it's gross. Taco Bell. It. Hell yes, Taco Bell. Now that's something I can get behind, I can get behind Taco Bell. Lady of Liberty, I love Taco Bell. No McDonald's hacks? I wouldn't say it's a hack, but just things I like to do with McDonald's is... Fresh hot fries right on a Big Mac. Mm -hmm. Hey, Lisa Marie. Simple, easy, delicious. If you're someone that likes a Big Mac, um, put your French fries on the Big Mac as a topping. It is so good. That qualifies as a hack. What about chocolate milkshake? Same thing. I'm a vanilla milkshake guy. Or strawberry. I don't really eat ice cream.
I used to eat hey, ice Jessica. cream, but I was never a milkshake person. Hello, Lisa Marie, fries and Big Mac. I haven't had it in a while, though. Maybe tomorrow you get a Big Mac. Right now, on going around is an Oreo McFlurry on a quarter pounder. An Oreo McFlurry on a quarter pounder. Now, French fries dipped in a Oreo McFlurry would be good. Well, French fries in a milkshake, I think that would be good. That's good. First of all, I've done the, the fries with the Frosty. That's good. Bad experience, John? Fries dipped in ice cream. Yes, that's good. I just don't actively eat ice cream. Hey, Victoria. How are you feeling, Khaki? How is Jamie's tummy? Loud. No, he's Oh, eating. yeah. Jamie's tummy is still... What's up, Andre? Still rumbling. Yeah. Um, I'm feeling a bit better, but my head hurts really bad. What am I having tonight? The same thing as Jamie. I have pizza. I plan on eating the crust with some sauce, and I have a salad. No, I don't know what it's wrong, Jimmy. I can't blame my belly grumbling and having the, you know what, because of my greens. I drink my greens every night. That's it's like, definitely not from the greens. That's a part of my diet. Um, I think I just, the co a combination of things just didn't mix well. No. Lisa, I never went to the doctor. Pain went away. Didn't go to the doctor. But they taste so good, John. I know. I get it. But now I have a head cold, so. I think there are a lot of... I'll trade this for that. I'd rather have this than what I was dealing hey, with. Hey, Nancy. Nancy. Uh, what was I going to... Me and... You guys remember that Super Size Me movie with McDonald's? The, I don't remember oh, so the weird. guy's name, but he did a documentary where he ate McDonald's for breakfast, lunch, either. and for dinner. And he was going to the doctors and all that stuff. Anyway, they did a um, they did a thing where they showed what a French fry, what a burger looks like after a certain amount of time. Oh, they did an experiment at the end of the show. They yeah, did, at the end of the movie, they did an experiment. I, we left that show, and the with, fries never molded. They never molded. But you know what Jamie did? He's like, I want McDonald's right now. I'm like... What I was going to say was... We, and this is an honest to God true story. We left that documentary with two different opinions on it. Two Kaki opposite said, opinions. Kaki said, I'm never doing McDonald's again. I actually went to McDonald's after the documentary and picked up lunch. <laughs> What's up, Lightning Survivor? True story. Only me, right? Only Jamie. He's like, yeah, oh, I, I want some McDonald's right now. After I know, this won't digest ever <laughs> in a controlled environment, let alone my own body. But let me just eat it anyway. I really don't eat McDonald's <laughs> a lot though anymore. <laughs> Filet of fish anymore. Maybe I eat McDonald's every day. We won't age. Possibly. I mean, court. You never know, but. Morgan Outlook was the man's name. <laughs> John had the fries the next day. There's something special about McDonald's. You could get into a car and not knowing what that person has for lunch, but if it's McDonald's, you'll be able to guess it. I literally, well, we picked up McDonald's for our daughter tonight. Mm -hmm. And the minute I got in the car, she goes, Oh, that smells so good. <laughs> Just like, oh my god. My birthday, my baby dog has, uh, has tummy issues. I'm feeding her chip, chicken, pumpkin, carrots, and pears. I hope she's better. Yeah, what, and whenever our dog has had like stomach issues, I always like boiled up some chicken, some rice, cooked up some eggs. Thank you. Pizza Anything is good. to like. Bind them if they're having tummy issues. Cortland, Cortland, Kagi told me what's what? going on with you. I ain't saying it on the air, um, but hope you're. I'm hoping. I'm. I'm. I'm, I'm, I'm oh. Storm is over again. Hoping you. I'm happy you're feeling better. Number one, number two. What'd you eat for dinner tonight? Better ish. Bitter ish. 
Still better. You're home. The choco smell that you just came out of the car. <laughs> True. It's all fast food's the same. It's all the same. Can you pass me a napkin, Kelly? Sure. Did you try a garlic knot? No. Oh, baby Jesus. Is good. <clears throat> no, I did not. I don't know what tomorrow is going to bring for us in dinner. We, uh... I might create something, and I might have a pizza as a side I piece. Better than me, yeah. Me too, Marks. I don't like brown rice. I think brown rice is nasty. I don't mind it. I don't like brown rice. Well, she was feeding it to her dogs, <laughs> and she said they ate it better than me <laughs> because they don't know no better. I'm hanging in there, my friend. You got a California burrito. I have um. I have a lot of shit to do tomorrow that I would normally do on a Friday, but I had we had so many errands to run when I could pick me up from work. I didn't get home to almost seven. You got home at six. No, I did not. And then I had to go back out. I didn't get home to almost seven. Almost seven, because I was out the door running by seven forty five. <laughs> so tomorrow will be <clears throat> cleaning day for me. If I were to show you guys what my cookie corner looks like right now, you'd be disgraced. You'd be like, I went off. to plug your tablet in today. I'm like... It's bad, I know. I've kept that room so damn clean. And it's then a, you just... It's a lot... Pile I, and pile and pile. And I don't... I, it happens out of nowhere. No, it doesn't. Yeah, uh-huh. All you have to do is like fold up whatever and just set it Somewhere, or put it in a drawer. It doesn't need to. Just my my side does not look like that. Whatever I use, either it goes in the hamper, or I fold them. I'm not working hand. tomorrow. No, Kaki is though. Yeah, I'm working tomorrow. I work freaking every day this week except for Wednesday. But it feels good, don't it? It's gonna feel good when I get that paycheck, and then it's already gone. It's going right to our phone bill. <laughs> Our phone bill and our son's pictures. Our phone bill is ridiculous. Yeah, it's which like, we, we need to get rid of Verizon. They suck. Big time. They're so expensive. I'll go for the ride, so... You look up what you should think we should do. I think we should go to T-Mobile. Mm. Or we go back to... What is it called? Imagine me and Kaki became Boost. Yeah, let's get Nextel. Nextel. Well, they don't they don't exist anymore. Nextel was dissolved into Sprint many, many, many years the ago. The walkie talkies they don't yep. do those anymore. No really? Nextel was dissolved into Sprint, and Sprint gave you a free iPhone because you had a Nextel. Nextel's gone. Nextel's been hey brown eyes. Nextel's been gone since like two thousand like seven. Everything. Eight. Every, everybody wants to go back to, like, the past with certain things. I and mean, it's only a matter of time before the next mm -hmm. album becomes a comeback. Or Beavers. Well, that shit's going to come back eventually. Thank you, Nancy. I was with Sprint. T-Mobile purchased them. And I've never been happier two years ago. You, I think T-Mobile is where we need to go. Oh, yeah. Because, honestly, <clears throat> Verizon's so damn expensive. And honestly, their service isn't that great. You have T-Mobile too. Very happy. Does my mom and dad have T-Mobile? Yes, they do. Mm. And I believe Fred and Martha have it as well. Well, to Chinese tomorrow night? Maybe. Mm. I could go for some dumplings and cheese fried wontons. No, I just had Chinese. You can get it. Sixteen dollars talking text better than it. You know how much our phone bill is? Now we have our phones and then our tablet which has a line on it. Mm hmm Anybody want to guess what we pay? Let's I'm gonna take guesses right now because Jamie doesn't know how much it is. But Two I cell do. phones and a and an iPad. What do I you don't think know how much it is. is? Yeah, I don't know. I know it's high though. So anybody wants to I'm gonna tell guess? you it's ridiculous. Mr. Savvy says two hundred and thirty dollars. Okay. 
First guess. I think that might be the only guess. Higher, lower. 320, 230, 320, 325, 340. All right, anybody that's over 300, you're too much. What is it? What's up, Frank? 270. 270, holy shit. 270. That's a lot of beans, man. That's a lot of money. And, to be frank, Frank, the service ain't even that damn good. The service sucks. It sucks. Half the time, my shit buffers when I'm not connected to Wi-Fi. <laughs> it's terrible. Even in our own My T-Mobile bill is $68 a month for unlimited streaming, and your phone is paid for. T-Mobile is where we're going. Do the work. <clears throat> Well, I, well if, as long as I don't have to do anything, Kagi, I'll go to T-Mobile. Well, then you're taking your phone, taking your phone number, and we're transferring everything. You're not getting a new phone, sir. You have Spectrum? I won't. I will not ever go to a Spectrum. If you know, you know. Now, what did you say about my phone? You're not getting a new phone. You're literally taking your phone. No, no, no. I'm due for a new phone. Yeah, through Verizon. Oh, I need a new phone. You don't need a new phone. Three twenty-five a month for cable? Holy shit. T-Mobile moved everything for me. I sat in a comfy chair and let them do the work. And I think that's what we're going to do. Because honestly, I'm over Verizon and they're inflated prices. I need a new phone. And nope. this phone will become this phone. And then you guys will get the new picture from the new phone. Well, guess or what? We're going to switch well. over. And then you can get your new phone. We're going to reduce our bill first before we create more money. Mm. Xfinity. Wait for the Christmas promotions where you get new phones if you switch. Thank you, Granny Vicky. I can't get T-Mobile over Ryzen. I owe them money. Well, damn, Frank. <laughs> <laughs> well, guess what, Frank? You saved yourself on Verizon because only they're overpriced. <laughs> I've heard nothing but negative things about Spectrum. Hello, Felicia. I've never even heard of Spectrum. Pizza again? Question mark, question mark. Yeah, since last Saturday is when I did it on here, Corey. What is Spectrum? I've never heard of Spectrum. Hmm. Well, so we have uh, whatever the hell we have. Yeah, we have Verizon. Yeah. The Spectrum is another one. Never heard of Spectrum, though. <clears throat> Mm -hmm. Only cable was. Oh, you saw that's the only choice is Spectrum. Oh, for cable? Yeah, we eat, we eat, we eat at midnight every night. Oh, Spectrum. So you live in Maine. That's the only change. The only choice you have for cable. That's not a cell phone. Oh. Well, I was thinking it was a cell phone. Mm -hmm. Spectrum complaints with XMA. Okay. So we have two different companies that compete too. And we can you can only get a certain company in a certain town. So mm -hmm. we we understand your pain. And they jack up prices and they make it completely ridiculous. So we understand. That's a good uh Corey. That's a very good uh opinion. If anybody wants to hear some funny shit <laughs> this is a great value version Google, of Comcast. And Google or type it on YouTube, Jim Cornette and Spectrum. And see what Corny has to say about <laughs> Spectrum Cable. I guess it's time for two cans and a super long string. I guess so, Court. Honestly, I think that's like the best time for it, like right now. Because 
That shit's free. You're embarrassed. Listen, I guarantee you, our cable bill is probably more than yours. <laughs> or it might be comparable. It's disgusting. It's it really probably is. almost $400 a month at this point. And the sad part is, mm -hmm. depending on who you are and where you work, money it, prices is going up everywhere, but the paychecks are staying the same. Mm -hmm. I've said that for years. Everything goes up but your paycheck. Their paychecks stay the same, but the cost of living is whoop, through the roof. Oh, uh, we don't pay for cable, no. No, no, no. It's included in rent. Just saying just saying that's what, you know. And how much the cable costs. You dislike Cornet? Hey, he's either some he's some people's cup of tea and a <laughs> lot of people he's not. I like him. I, I actually like him a lot. What's oh, your, Jamie likes him a lot. I, on the other hand. What's your thoughts on Kevin Nash? I love Kevin Nash. I don't. When you're forced to watch something, or listen to something, rather, that you don't want to listen to. Not forced to do it. I was forced. I had no other choice. I want to clarify something, because both Cornette and Kevin Nash are very much into like the political their political views. And you guys know I don't talk about politics or religion or any of that stuff. Um, I like both of them because of their wrestling minds and their attitudes. Nothing to do with politics. And I think one is... I, and I think All they're right, on opposite no, sides too, anyway. Uh, yeah, Frank, I, I would agree. Mm. Everything is ridiculously expensive. Groceries yesterday spent 150 And my kids said, it didn't even look like you bought anything. Yeah, no. Oh, no. Hey, you Munchkin. probably didn't, my milk. You probably didn't buy a whole lot because the price of everything is What'd you yell insane. at me for tonight buying? Oh, my God. He went into Walgreens to get his chocolate. Mm -hmm. And then he ended up buying ice cream in there, too. But he knew I had to go into another store to get milk. No, I did not. I no. told you we needed milk. and I wasn't listening. I know. And plus... He spent six... 70 something on a gallon of ice cream. Edie's. In Walgreens. 670 something on freaking ice cream. A gallon of ice cream. When we could have gone into like the supermarket know. and spent like two and change on a freaking gallon of ice I cream. I thought I was saving a trip. Not going no, you were not saving store. a trip because we still have to get milk anyway. <sighs> well, I didn't know. Yeah, I know because you don't listen to me. You don't pay attention. Mr. We need to save as much money as we can. Spend six seventy nine on a gallon of ice cream because do. he doesn't look at prices. Our money game. Plus, with the holidays coming up, we are going to have to do something different these next Our three weeks. Our money game starts with Jamie not spending any money at all. I don't plan on going to buy anything. <laughs> no, it's just my money game. You I don't spend a damn thing. I know <laughs> what I need. Right? And my plan is to stay away from the stores. I might have to go to a fabric store. But that's for a project. And it's not expensive what I need. Walgreens and TPS are so expensive. I know. Which I don't know why the hell you decided to get ice cream there. That's where I can get my chocolate. And that's the only thing I buy there is your chocolate. It's the only thing I buy there. I don't buy anything else except for the Oreos last week because the Oreos last week, they were two for seven or one for $6.29. So, of course, I'm going to buy two for seven. I'm going to get one basically for free. Do you guys eat traditional Thanksgiving meals or soup it up? Um, mm -hmm. So, my parents make Thanksgiving. Um, and we'll eat with them. And then for like our dinner stream. Hey Jen. Usually I'll, I'll create something from dinner. I'll make burritos or a sandwich or something. I don't know what I'm doing this year. Yeah, I've made Thanksgiving tacos. Those were delicious. 
Yeah. Uh, I really don't know what I'm doing this year. Yeah, yeah, me neither. I might do a Thanksgiving pizza. Mm. Not what you're thinking either. Like from like regular like dough. Like actually get a cheese pizza. Oh. Hear me out. Take it apart, and reassemble it my way. What are Thanksgiving tacos, you ask? Those are absolutely delicious. <laughs> and I've made them many times. I was doing it before Khaki did it. You've never made a Thanksgiving taco before I did. Yes, I have. No, you haven't. Look at our past. Nope. You made a Thanksgiving sub. Yeah. I've done I it. made a Thanksgiving taco. You did it first. You want to go back five years? Go ahead. How are you going to... Certain things I remember. And not using real Thanksgiving food either. It was the hungry man. Well, I used actual Thanksgiving food to make a Thanksgiving taco. Um, a hungry man doesn't count. Turkey stuffing gravy, yeah. Basically. So it was it was like turkey stuffing, mashed potatoes, gravy. Um, I'm off tomorrow. Um, cranberry sauce. So good. So good. And an actual taco shell. Mm -hmm. If you eat at midnight, what's my work schedule? Um, I'm usually up between 6.45 and 7.30. It's like the latest I have to get out of bed. Yes, Jen. We actually do regular t traditional turkey and all the dressings. Mm -hmm. We do, but then like we usually take them, whatever was made and then we'd make something else with it. My dad deep fries the turkeys. Mm -hmm. My mom is up bright and early doing stuffing and like all the fixings and then I'm moping around because I hate Thanksgiving. And I'm also in the kitchen helping. Cooking, cleaning. All I'm doing is moping around. Nothing against Thanksgiving. I just hate the fact that everybody's closed and everybody's like. Everybody's spending time with their families? That's not what <laughs> it is. I just, I don't know. I've never liked that Thanksgiving, Easter, Halloween for the longest time, but I've come around to being a Halloween fan. I'll even give Thanksgiving a pass. It's Easter. I oh, hello, like. Melissa. Miss you too, girl. Well, looks delicious. Thank you. Easter Long has no chance. Girl. Yeah, Jamie just doesn't like Easter. Easter is one hundred percent out the. I'm not a, I'm not an Easter fan. I can get around that. I can see myself liking Thanksgiving because it's like all my brothers are hanging out. You know, my mom and dad are grumpy as fuck, arguing about shit in the kitchen about what they should be doing and what needs to be done. You want fried turkey and you live in Louisiana. <laughs> it's a fun day. I never had a good one. Oh, well, you need to try Jamie's dad's turkey because <clears throat> he knows what he's doing. He fries that sucker to perfection. And then, and then we all fight over the skin. Not me. I never get it. But here's the thing. I don't battle over the skin. I literally sit back and wait. Because your my dad, dad gives it to you. Your dad is just like, oh, you're not arguing for it. Here you go. It gives me the biggest piece. My brothers are seagulls and just <sighs> are hawking over them. They, they need to learn the strategy. And then he gives me the biggest piece, and they're like, oh, that's so wrong. I'm, like, I'm not sitting there begging for it. I'm just waiting patiently. Ah, Bajon Rouge. You ever had Kansas, Kansas dirt cake? Mm -mm. No. I, I've never even heard of that. Thanksgiving dinner in your family is delicious. I'm sure it is. I give you guys a rundown of what will be here Thanksgiving, right? Because it's pretty, my mom has been talking the last couple of days about trying to do something different. But for the most part, here's the rundown. Deep fried turkey. Um, yams. Yeah, with, this, with the marshmallows, I'm not a fan of those. Uh, cheesy Jimmy Crack Corn. Oh, the Crack Corn's my favorite. And there's Stuffing, cheese. two different kinds, because mm -hmm. my brother doesn't like stuff that's in the one, the, the he doesn't like yeah. He doesn't like the stuffing. vegetables and the regular stuffing. 
Uh huh. There's gravy. There's mashed potatoes. There's cheesy bacon green beans. Mm hmm. Yep. This year, I might make my homemade stuffing, which I haven't come up with yet, but I'm sure it will be good. White pudding things away. Oh, while putting things away. Yep, that's my parents. They clean up, they put away. We eat Thanksgiving dinner, and then my dad and brother eat a second dinner over the sink <laughs> while putting things away. <laughs> Big bro, what's up, Parko? What's up, Grim? Do you run first and then eat? Yeah. Deep fried turkey is so... You want to try it? Oh my God, my mouth. That I puts your turkey game... No. On a whole different level. It tastes so much better. Grim. <clears throat> I could not I couldn't I couldn't run after this. Hello from Italy. Hello, how are you? No way. We are trying deep fried this year. Fingers crossed. Oh Kelly McDonald. I hope all goes well with deep fried turkey because honestly There's lots of videos of what you should not be doing. Should and should not do. But I will tell you right now. When executed correctly, it is delicious. People overfill it. People burn the oil. They don't dry the turkey enough before they put it into the oil. They don't cook it in a proper area. Mm -hmm. Don't fry it in your garage or in your house. Hey, Jamie, do you remember <laughs> me? <laughs> Grim? No. Ring a... Do, <clears throat> If you give me something that rings my bell, maybe. How you do? Can you click on Grimm's profile? Let's see, Grimm. I don't. Grimm kind of sounds okay. familiar. It does. Private. Oh. Uh, no. You're, uh, I've seen videos, fires happening, cooking deep fried turkeys, yeah. Mm. We had bacon to the top of the cream. Well, the way that Jamie's mom makes it is she mixes cheese and bacon into the casserole. You gave me motivation and inspired me to, to do better and work out. Well, I hope you're doing better. <laughs> I need the motivation now. <laughs> I'm happy I helped you, though. Videos on fires. Excuse me. I got a new job too. Awesome. Congratulations. I could use one of those too. Uh, I'm joking. No, I have it's not, I'm, actually I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I could well, use I'm it. joking. Actually, I'm not joking, guys. I just want a new job. I, I like my mm -hmm. job. I just need more money, honey. I'm having trouble finding a new job. Can't find a job anywhere. It's terrible. I mean, I still have a job, but I'm looking for something else. I gifted you. Thank you. How got you guys are rude? JK? Didn't even see it, but thank you. I said JK. Just kidding. Oh. I, yeah. Anybody that gives us and we don't acknowledge it, we didn't see it. We didn't see it. So, please don't be like that. No, that's not a joke. <laughs> that's not really a joke. Hmm. And we never ask for gifts either. Yeah, ever. no, we don't ask for that ever. ever. So, if you feel compelled to gift, we are very thankful. But if we didn't see it, I'm sorry. Comments go really fast. Thank you, Sean. And Lucky has to go out as usual. Hear me out. Oh, Kaki's doing that. I know I have always said that I don't do challenges, but challenges are on my mind as of late. Because I know I could eat. I wouldn't do speed. But do you think it would be fun to do? Once a week? Maybe, depending on how it goes. Um, a couple times a month. Kaki would have to do most of the talking because I would be doing the eating. But if I were to do it, should I go with the 10 Big Macs first? I love that you never ask for anything. You yeah. never ask for anything. And the, and there's there's reasoning why. And we will never ask for anything ever. 
We do this for fun. Well, I'll ask if I need something. <laughs> no, we do this for fun. Listen, I got I got younger brothers that uh I thought Lucky wanted to go out. It's Abby wanting by the back door because she wants food. I want well, to see you, you kill Tim Big Max. I know you can do it. Oh, I know I could do it too, Munchkin. I know I could do it too. Um, I just don't know. My sister in law is gonna. Oh my god. Fund it. And our sister in law is just like, you could do ten Big Macs. I'll buy them for you. <laughs> and Jamie's just like, she's like, she. All right. <laughs> no. We were talking about McDonald's or whatever, and she goes. Oh no. <laughs> Jamie's stomach's going. <laughs> That's Billy, loud. I don't know if you guys can hear it. Belly's back <laughs> at it again. We were talking about McDonald's and something happened like, how many Big Macs do you think you eat? And I said 10. And then my sister in law goes, she goes, you should do a Big Mac challenge. And I said, I, I said, do you know how much a Big Mac is? She goes, I don't care. I'd want to see it. I'll buy it. I'll buy it, but I have to sit there and watch you eat it. <laughs> <laughs> I have to sit there and watch you eat it. <laughs> and he was like, all right. <laughs> I don't think he could do 10. I think he could force himself to do 10. Well, my goal... And then feel like complete shit. Yeah. But my... I think he could comfortably eat like six. My goal would be to um, not eat a lot the night before. Run a decent amount, maybe 10 to 12 miles. If I could even still do that anymore. But if my mind is focused on something, I know the little breadcrumbs that I have to follow in order to get to where I need to go. What about a White Castle Crave case? That's a good idea, too. I, you've I, done a Crave case on me before. Never. You've done you've done cases... A full one? I, don't know, I? I think you split it with your brother. Yeah, no, I would do a full case. I'm going to be doing a White Castle. Because I don't eat White Castle, so... If Jamie's doing a crave case, that's all on him. I don't eat White Castle. I don't eat McDonald's either. White Castle is the only company in the six years I've been doing this that saw something in me and paid me very nicely. <laughs> yeah, and put me under true. contract. Yeah, so, Court. I think I'm he's going to need the toilet soon. <laughs> forever, forever grateful to White Castle. 17 miles is your most? Nice. 20 was mine. So willing to give you 19.95 for that red drink recipe. How much? <laughs> 19.95. Sorry, pal. Then Khaki has to sleep with you post 10 Big Macs. Yeah, well, here's the thing. Here's the thing, Mark. Once my head hits the pillow, I'm out like a light. I hear nothing. Until my alarm goes off. And half the time, I don't even hear my alarm. So We don't have that. it in and out. <laughs> yeah, we don't we have never it. never had it. My MILF and you do a taco challenge. I could do the taco challenge while Jamie's doing the Big Macs. You can eat your Big Macs while I eat my tacos. Mm. I don't know. My whole thing is, and I'm going to be very honest with you guys, with the whole challenge... I want to see if I could do it because I do love to eat. And at the same time, I'm trying to bring more attention to me because what I've been doing has uh, cooled down to the point where it's I like my account is coming out the freezer. It's cold. So I feel like, and I and I know I have a good story. With oh, everything, good night, John. Everything I've done with Kagi and losing the weight and stopping drinking and being consistent on here, I feel like I need something to kind of bring eyes back to me. So that's why I'm thinking about the challenge. Jamie, what about the big cereal, cereal bowl, bowl challenge? challenge. <gasps> big Mac challenge will bring views. That's exactly what our sister in law was saying. You eat 10 Big Macs, people are gonna watch it. People are gonna see it. But, but once again, I don't want it to be a consistent thing well, yeah. and then just use food as a talent. You know what I mean? Like people do crazy and if I did do it it would be it wouldn't be edited and fast forward where I'm taking breaks. It would be a it would be a casual live dinner. The only difference is I've got ten fucking Big Macs in front of me. 
know. Well, so, Sean Gutierrez it's said, an idea. time to switch it up, baby. I believe in you, brother. Yeah. Well, I'm think I'm 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 definitely thinking about it. I'm definitely thinking about it. Build Legos. <laughs> I, build no, Legos. I'm double jointed. I can't build Legos. My our son is a wizard. Our son builds Legos like it's nobody's business. He builds Legos for like 18 and up. And he's nowhere near 18. <laughs> he he built the whole, if you know anything about Legos, he built the whole <sighs> TV set Nintendo with the video game that pops in and out with the freaking controller. I think it was like a 6,000 piece set. Wrestling match? It was like a 240 something dollar set of Legos. That child built at the age of seven. <laughs> I uh, don't mean to be rude, boys and girls, but we have to end this because I got to use the bathroom. And this was years ago, but really that's bad. just to tell you how impressive he is with Legos. <sighs> I have to use the bathroom really bad. So, with that, thank you guys for hanging out with us tonight. I don't know what's for tomorrow. Maybe it'll be Chinese uh, with the side of pizza, but we'll see. We'll see. Good night, guys. Have a good night, guys. Oh. <laughs>